hello, hello, Danger Noodles. It is I, the Great Doctor, right here. And, um, we're, the first game of horror games we're playing tonight is A Wonderful Day for Fishing. Bait worm. Fish got away, but the worm's still alive. At least, I'm not eating a fucking worm. What the fuck? This is nice and peaceful, don't you think, guys? Nice and peaceful. No, I'm not eating the goddamn worm. Catfish, its whiskers tickle my fingers. <laughs> well, I mean, it's a regular fish, so I, I can eat that. I eat a fish. Everything's normal so far. Another catfish, I'll eat it. Eating all the catfish. I'm making it go extinct. There's nothing anybody can do to stop me. Oh. Sand trout. The smell is intoxicating. Okay. I'll eat it. Now I smell intoxicating. <laughs> So peaceful. Um, hmm, 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 hmm. No. <laughs> oh. What have I done? Red snappers. Red scales shimmer in the sunlight. Eat it. Oh, I'm back to normal. Okay. I became eyeless Jack for five seconds. <laughs> Go flounder. It, in its pearly eyes, I see its future demise. Yeah, because I eat it. I feel the tar inside me. Release. I'm not eating that. Oh, god damn it. Wonder if anyone's actually here. Oh, here we go. Saltwater bass. A disgusting piece of living waste. Eat it. It's like a normal fish. Just, just, we're just fishing. We're just fishing. Just a wonderful day for fishing. So relaxing. So, so relaxing. Oh god, what the fuck happened to my mouth? What happened to my mouth? Wait a minute. Go flounder, it's out of its element. Eat it. Okay, I'm back to normal. Uh, 
Red Snapper. Its head whispers to me. How? It has no head. I'm not eating that. eating only normal fish. There's nothing wrong with anything we're doing. Just eating normal fish. <sighs> Relaxing. <laughs> My failure. Um, the drunk. I figure in his mouth scratches, trying to escape. Yeah, not eating that. Nope, nope, fuck that. It's Fred Scales with salty eyes. Oh. Okay, I guess it's getting. Later in the day, but that's fine because we're just we're just fishing. There's nothing wrong with this game. Nothing bad at all. Everything's just fine. Just fishing. No, there's nothing wrong with that fish. I just decided to just release it. That's all. There's nothing wrong with it. it smells like swine feed. Yeah, let's eat it. <laughs> Man, I'm eating so much delicious fish. Also, how big is my fucking stomach to eat all this fish? That's a real confusing thing, because how am I surviving? When my stomach implode on itself by now? By eating all this fish? It flops furiously in my hand. Fish. There's nothing wrong with that. So let's just keep eating fish. Flush cube. It pulsates. It wants to become a part of me. No. Uh. Um. What have I done? Harvey, why this becoming for my flesh? No. What have I done? No. Sir, you've eaten enough fish. Get the land. No. Give me a normal fish and I'll eat that. Yep, there we go. Normal fish. Normal fish. Let's just keep fishing. Normal fish and eating normal fish. Uh, we, we can be concerned by why the, the water's red later. Just keep 
eating normal fish. Part of me, fuck off. I don't want the flush cube, but the flush cube wants me. Everything's fine. Fuck it. Next time we get a flush key, we're eating it. Fuck. Water bug, its fangs sink into my flesh. I feel awakened. No. What the fuck was that? No. Oh god, god damn it. There goes my eyes. Me the flesh cube were fish. That's it. Oh, there we go. Oh, and the boat's sinking. That's just great. The boat is sinking, but I am still fishing. Let's just eat everything that I get. I just fished at the bottom of the fucking ocean. There's no like game over. <laughs> well, I'm making a game over. Okay, so that was a wonderful day for fishing. That was... Something, to say the least. game up I 
Alright, thanks. Alright. Apparently this does have a, a stream category, which is good. If anyone is watching, uh, type boobies. That way I know if you're in here. Up there it goes. Next game, a game about literally doing your taxes. Keep taxes. Toss trash. Jesus Christ. Oh, tax returns. This is going to be my signature. All right, now we go. I am so fucking immature. <laughs> Good job. Oh. All right. And bookworm, this is for you, because you got me this. Uh, invigorate to give vigor to to strength. To strengthen, to animate, to give life and energy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. Oh shit, that's trash. Honestly, I have no idea if this actually is... a horror game or not. Oh shit, I had the wrong button done. Bad job. Okay. I'm guessing bills are also taxes.
Yeah, because now my money goes positive. What the fuck? I literally heard a whisper of something and I don't know what. What the fuck? I can't tell if that was the game or something. I heard a whisper or something. What the f I'm not in, even in a voice call. So what the fuck? What the fuck was that? I heard it again. What the fuck? What the fuck? Pinball is <laughs> Okay, fuck off. I know that was you that time. I swear, I'm hearing fucking whis whispering. I swear to fuck. Yeah, I hear it too. Okay, I'm not going crazy. At first, I didn't think this was a horror game, but now it's a fucking horror game. <laughs> I was going crazy for a minute. Anyways, now I gotta do my signature. That is not piss. Are bills or taxes. Taxes done. I didn't do any taxes. Oh yeah, bookworm. Before I continue, um, me having COVID was actually a false positive. I actually had the flu. That's actually probably why I sound way better, because I had better medicine, but I'm still dealing with the flu. <coughs> but yeah, I had the flu, not COVID. Feeling trapped? Look no further. Call 1 800. Please help, please. So you touch one bullet into another. Yeah. Oh, that gives me money. Been hearing that COVID and the flu have been double teaming people lately, so it makes sense. Yeah. Do you ever feel watched? Ace Home Security. No, not personally. What the fuck? What? I, 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 excuse me? What the fuck was that?
I apparently can't keep my coffee in one place. My calculator says error. Oh shit. That that was good. I thought this would this was just a QC game at first. But <sighs> crazy because these prices are 20% off all store items. Music stopped. Does it even matter? We've been through this. What the fuck? Oh, what the fuck? None of these are bills or taxes. Look, from what did I get myself into? I just wanted to do my taxes. What did I get myself into? I sh oh, I, I can hit both buttons at the same time. Okay, there we go. Do you really want to go back? Yes or no? I can't... I can't even go yes. Oh my god. I don't want to go back. Let's go. Back, let's go. Right, right, right. <laughs> let's go back. Buy it, buy it, buy now, buy, buy, buy. Go back to sleep. The pills help. Tax. Left. <laughs> Might as well do that. Bye, bye, bye. Yeah, fuck it, we'll buy a house. <coughs> Go back to sleep. Oh my god. What the f Fuck.
Would you like to go back? Uh, yes? I mean, I was forced to say yes last time. Okay. Everything's fine. for being a good citizen and doing your taxes. I didn't know doing your taxes gets you in prison, but okay. What the fuck did I play? I was not prepared. on itch.io and didn't even say it was a horror game. I just got it to be, play a goofy game. But I ended up being a horror game. Oh yeah, bookworm. You missed the game. Oh, a, a game about me pl uh, fishing stuff, and apparent, and um, yeah, it was weird. The ocean turned blood for some reason. Game the grain wood, a uh, game grain wind, uh, grain wood incident 77. I know how to speak. <laughs> I gotta put it in the twitch category though. All right. An urban explorer enters the grain wind production factory. The premise has been long abandoned and shut down by many years ago due to an unknown circumstances. A recovered tape known as Instant 77 is found near the premise, showing the events that took place before the tape was discovered. Okay. This is a shitty tape. All I'm hearing is metal clanging. Oh, wait, wait, what? Oh, wow.
The worst part about this is it feels like I'm actually there. Also, this looks less like a factory and more like a school. So I've been to a school that looks exactly like this. That is a vacuum. I should not touch that. Okay. Everything coming through stream all right? Yep, all right. Oh God. D Sir, your factory has a hole in the floor. And again, looks more like a school than a fucking factory. Oh, I get it. This is the old... I see the crouch. Why do I need to crouch? Why do I need to crouch? Why is there any need to crouch? This is the, it feels like the exact opposite of 087. Instead of going downstairs, I'm going upstairs. I cannot read Russian. Go through tight space person C. Oh god, the game wants me to do this. I don't want to do this. I would leave immediately. Oh god. I mean, from the outside it looks like a factory, but the inside it looks like a fucking school. Oh. That's unsettling. <laughs> Fuck away from that. There's nothing over here. Oh, I can actually run. I didn't know I can run the entire time. Okay. I'm obviously a white person because I'm still investigating instead of leaving. What the fuck? The old man just flashed. Oh, it just got in my fucking face. And it made me laugh. Not scare me. That's. that's. Oh my god. Why was there an old man in my face? 
Unless he was a factory owner, then yeah, then that is scary. Oh, there's no more stairs up. Hey! You need help? I can help you. You alright? How are you? It's wrong. <laughs> God damn it! I knew it was coming. Lust? Hi. Fuck were you? Where was this guy? First, the English newspaper starts in Moscow. Ongoing losses proceeds towards Greenwood facility as the CEO and owner of the facility is going bankrupt. In other news, the production and processing of produce has been halted by 70%. The facility has not met protocol or ongoing standards. Further involvement into the matter awaits. People in here are being treated like garbage. Work-related death incident reports at Greenwood Production Factory. A worker has lost his life this weekend when an oil canister exploded nearby as he was working on the elevator shaft. The explosion proved to be fatal as the man fell to his death while lit on fire and was dead before he even hit the bottom of the elevator. Our condolences go out to his family. Further investigation into the facility's safety measures awaits. So that old guy was a corrupt CEO. Well, he did go up, so let's go down. Oh, there's lights now. You know what, Buckhorn? Let's just leave this place. We don't need to be here. We can just leave. There's, there's no reason to stay here. It's okay to be a pussy. Let's just leave. Jesus! God fucking damn it! can't leave. It's all boarded up. Oh, you motherfuckers. Now I'm stuck here. I'm stuck here with these bastards. I just wanted to leave Bookworm. Is that too much to ask? Is it too much to ask, Bookworm? Just so you know, you're you're with me, so 
if I die, you also die. So that's how it works. We haven't even gotten started. Okay, going down the ladder. But I have no idea where the fuck to go. I don't like the how the the moaning stop. Uh, oh, thank you. God damn it. Again, that bastard. I honestly don't know what I'm supposed to do. Jump. Oh, 
I wonder if I can jump off here. I was not supposed to do that, bookworm. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, whatever. Oh! Moscow news this week. Further tragic news about the Grace Wind production facility. Due to being overworked and working upwards of 100 hours a week, workers have become ill, and this week, an even worse fate occurred. A young man jumped from the railing of the silo area at the facility. The man was killed in an instant, and his family are heartbroken. They are blaming the facility for causing him to do this. The facility CEO has not spoken out yet, but interviewers are trying to get to him. So I'm guessing we're supposed to find one of those. I can't go down there yet. In each area, a person has died. Which means there should be one in here somewhere. Yeah, it didn't scare me this time. Unless I'm wrong. Cause you know, I'm not finding a newspaper in here. Dead body. Yeah, we already read that. We already read that. Wait. Okay, so Curl also crouches, but C gets me to crouch even more. So I'm like, when I I'm, press C, I'm crawling on the ground.
Or that door being shut. So I never opened it. Okay, so that. So the ringing of that was different this time. Hi. This is new. I don't know what else I'm supposed to find. Because I've already checked the rooms. There's nothing else in the rooms. I guess I can check the big area again. See if there's anything different. Jesus. Fuck. Oh, this is a different area. Oh. I never went here. charge of event at Greenwood facility occurred this week when a 25 year old woman was found at the bottom of one of the large grape salad containers the woman broke her neck in an in an instant fall from the fall River City event occurred due to the old rusty ladders found within some of the silos further investigation awaits how many people are gonna die before they fucking close the goddamn factory So that's what I'm supposed to be doing. I'm supposed to find those newspapers. So, Bookworm, since you're here, you gotta help me find those newspapers. You gotta help me look hard. Deep. I believe we got this one, right? Blah. Yeah, we got that one. Oh, here's another opening area. And newspaper. I'll try it, but I haven't played another game while I watch. Grain wind protection facility pr produces 10 tons of processed grain every month. The use and purpose of the 12 grain silos at Greenwind is a part of the farming process which is to store excess grain product that can be used and sold commercially in the future. As the company is off schedule in its production, food regulators and factory inspectors have been called to the facility. I had a I barely saw that jump scare because I was reading the newspaper. Can I not read a newspaper in peace?
Oh, there's a hidden ladder over here. Can't see in that direction. So. Oh, because there's nothing in that direction. Okay, <laughs> I would have died. There's another one. I okay, there was just a face. They nearly pushed me off the edge. Fuck you. Oh, there's another path over here. Okay. I know there was a, a steppy area that I could have gone to. I've already been down there. Oh, I did not notice that before. Wait a minute. Hold the fuck on a minute there. This was not here a moment ago. Hold on a second here. Wait a fucking minute. Here's another one. Jesus! Oh, what the fuck? Why are we in a church? Bookworm, what cult did you take me to? Oh, hi. There's so many, I don't know. I tried leaving. Ending one of three. The tape was recovered by an abandoned church nearby in the same town that a Greenwood production facility is located. An urban explorer's dead body was found by local police in an abandoned church. The body has, had been severely mutilated 
in the words Desidite were carved in, into the chest of the victim. Further investigation into the events leading up to the tragedies are being looked into by federal authorities. The abandoned church and old Greenwood facility are were connected in a series of ritualistic sacrifices and missing people were forced throughout the years. Apparently these people worshipped some woman who died at age 25 in one of the grain store silos as an entity had taken over the, the girl's body and the people nearby are said to have sacrificed people to appease this said entity. Further interviews and investigation is to be done as the content of the recover tape is still being analyzed the further I mean, the, the event has been named incident 77 no further questions will be fabled to be answered regarding this case that's interesting so me dying was not an ending like I mean jumping off the roof dying <laughs> I'm pretty sure it was probably going to be a tape where I survive. Alright, so let me put that as incomplete. So I want to play some other games as well. We can finish that game another time. so many games to look through. Fuck. Alright, let's see if this one has a... Uh, Stream category. Doubt it. Try to open the game, nothing happened. Oh, there it goes. So, no, this does not have a Twitch category. My god, the game is loud. Elevator. Okay. 
Okay. It's holding the spreads button. Open that, I can open that now. That no, no. I guess there's nothing bad that's on there so far. I think I got on the wrong floor. But I'll still come over here and investigate because I'm white. Flashlight. That's great. Worst part is, is I can't run. I can only walk. Oh, I don't like this. The fuck. Okay. I don't even know what the hell that thing was. Is that the legendary Jizz monster? Do you know, Bookworm, if that was the legendary Jizz monster? Not messy enough. Is this messy enough? Let's get in there. <laughs> You have nothing to do here. Oh, well, th that's just great. Thanks. <coughs> Thanks for telling me that by walking all the way down there instead of just leaving it on the fucking body. Oh. I'm going to die. How am I alive? Especially when that was on top, that fell on top of me. Hi. Giant eyeball.
That was something. Next game is also an elevator horror game. If it'll load, please don't destroy my PC. And I believe this one has multiple endings. God, let me take care of sound. It's a very, very small window. I can't change it. It'll be bigger. Anyways. Nice to meet you, stranger. Let me welcome you to the elevator. Let me just turn it down just a bit more. Sorry. I'm the elevator girl. I'll be your assistant for today. For anything else, I advise you to keep your hands away from the walls and do not move around too much. The company won't pay for any injuries that might occur on the way down, so please be careful. In the past, we've had issues with lost limbs stuck in the mechanisms. Not a pretty sight, as you imagine. Also, very expensive to clean up. But don't worry. If you stand perfectly still, the chances of something going wrong are less than 50%. She's kind of cute. Now, please don't be impatient, dear. Stranger, this is a very long trip down. Let's take this chance to get to know each other. Oh, you know, you once were at the we are near our first stop. There's still a long way to go. So for now, please relax and enjoy my company. Still a long way to go. Yeah, I probably shouldn't annoy her because I'll probably get. Okay, so this game has multiple endings. That much I do know. to our first stop. What 
What's up, bro? No getting ahead. Take your ticket and wait. We call this floor the waiting room. People that don't have the patience to endure the trip down are left here. We spent a long time here waiting for something or perhaps waiting for nothing at all. All that's clear is that they wait, they wait a lot. A lot they wait. Yo, bro, I've been here a long time waiting for. Wait. What was I waiting for? Anyway, bro, did the rubber boy ever find a single piece? Oh my god. No, he hasn't had to find it. I was a big fan of that show, but sadly never got to see how it ended. It has yet to end. Of course, people that leave here can't get into the elevator again. That's a no-go. Elevator, what's that? Anyway, I'm back to waiting. Have a nice day, you both. Well, I don't think this is your stop. So let's keep going deeper and deeper, shall we? Our next stop is still a few minutes away. Do you want to chat for a bit? I was reading a story earlier. You've probably heard about it. It's a fairly popular one. The tale of the tortoise and the hare. Well, in case you don't remember it, it goes somewhat like this. There was once a tortoise and a hare that decided to have a race between them. The hare would often mock the tortoise for being so slow. So when the day of the race came, the hare easily outpaced the tortoise and got close to the finish line in no time. Seeing the slow pace of the tortoise, the hare got cocky and decided to take a nap, as it was impossible that the tortoise would ever catch up. But then the hare slept for so long that the tortoise managed to slowly but steadily get to the finish line and beat the hare. Quite the story, don't you think? It's easy to draw par parallels and realize there are so many there are many hares and tortoises out there. Now tell me, stranger, would you consider yourself a hare or a tortoise? Hmm. I feel like the bad choice is the hare. The tortoise, huh? The story was constructed in a way to make the tortoise appear to be the hero. But I disagree with that notion. The tortoise is just as bad as the hare. If you're hard working, you put in the effort to always be on top. You wouldn't let yourself go so much that you become life and like everyone else. Furthermore, the tortoise victory was a fluke that relied on the hare's incompetence, not the tortoise's effort. They are both incredibly lazy. Well, hare or tortoise, it doesn't matter. I'm sure our next four will be of interest to you. Here we are. Let me welcome you to the factory. The factory is the pride and joy of our company. We make everything here from jewelry to insulin to firearms, it's all here. All our systems are automated too, the robots handle all the work, so being one of our employees is extremely easy. I asked you about the hair and the tortoise earlier because you seemed lazy to me, and I think I was right. So I wanted to make you an offer. We are currently hiring and need someone just like you. Someone to do absolutely nothing. Also, the pay is pretty good to boot. Would you be interested? I'll pass. This is probably an ending. I want to get... I want to keep going down. So you don't want to work for us? That's such a shame. Well, maybe the factory work isn't for you. It's alright, it's alright. We have other positions too. Maybe our next stop will be more to your liking. Oh yes, in the meantime, would you like to play a game? Here's our new slot machine prototype. What makes it different from other slot machines, are you wondering? Well, it's free to play, so... Feel free to give it as many attempts as you want. The one condition is to get three of the same number in a row. I'll let you do your thing. Please enjoy. Oh, 
Yeah, enough for a slot machine already? That's such a shame, but oh well. We've arrived at to our next stop in a moment. And here we are. Oh, I could have played it and nothing bad would have happened. Okay, never mind. <laughs> well, that was stupid for me to do. Let me welcome you to the office. This is where most brilliant and ambitious employees work. As opposed to the factory, this place isn't automated, but you get paid accordingly to the amount of effort you put in. The employee of the office, employees of the office are an integral part for the development of the company. Pretty new products that later get made in the factory or new ideas to improve productivity. Salaries here start at 100k USD per hour. Huh, a newbie? You should definitely join us. In fact, you should work under me. Ah oh yes, if you enter as an apprentice of someone, your senior will get a, a portion of your income in exchange for mentorship. I work 24 hours a day, 7 days a week. I also have over 250 apprentices. I'm probably one of the richest people in the world right now. Coo -coo -coo -coo. That's not enough. I need more. Come my apprentice. With your help, I'll be able to, to get the absolute top. I'll become the CEO of this company. Then I'll fund new companies to become even richer. So join me. You won't regret it. Please don't be so pushy with the stranger. Shut up, elder girl. You'll see. In no time, you'll work for me, too. I'll own you and your stupid elevator. Just you wait and see. We'll see about that. Oh, if I kept doing the slot machine, I probably would have been stuck in there. Oh, okay. Well, I don't think the stranger would be a good fit for this floor anyway. Let's keep going deeper. Okay, so choices do matter. And on we go. We just chat for a bit while we get the to the next destination. What do you think of the this season so far? Hope you're having a good time. After the last stop, you'll, you'll surely wish to go back into the elevator, that's for sure. <laughs> Never mind that. But it's all good. The company really appreciates people like you. Even more so... You're exactly what we are looking for. I've been working here for over 50 years, so I know what I'm talking about. You do not look 50 years old. Or over 50. You you look rather young. Oh, God, Darren. I still clicked out of the game. When I see someone with big potential, I can identify so immediately. That's elevated girl for you. I, too, am great at my job. Oh, we finally arrived to our next stop. This floor is... <laughs> 69. Actually, let's get this floor, shall we? Aww. I wanted to see the floor. Oh, sorry. Is my singing bothering you? This is a long trip to sit down, so sometimes I get distracted. I'm sorry. Well, now that I think about it, you must be hungry for right now, right? We happen to have a full course meal service at this elevator, so feel free to eat whatever you want. Hold on a second, I'll bring you the menu. So choose what dish you like to eat. I see. Good choice. Now for the main course. I guess 
salad. Another good choice. Finally, please choose your dessert. Okay. I actually don't like banana splits, so I guess I'll go with fruits. Alright, now please enjoy your meal. I hope that was tasty. I can't help but notice you didn't touch any of the dishes with animal products in them. I hope you don't live under the illusion that you're guilt-free for only eating plants. Plants are also living beings just like you and me. They might be incapable of complex thought. They can still feel in fear as they are murdered for your consumption for our consumption. In their own way, of course. But who says we have the moral high ground to say who gets eaten only because of higher intellect? Well, I hope you at least understand the entitlement of your of yours when eating other living beings. It's an eat eat or be eaten kind of world, I suppose. Well, but enough about food. Let's chat a bit more. We're still a long way down. A question. Do you have pets? I do have pets. I see. What the fuck? Wait. Mm -hmm. Bookworm. I want you to look at this first and see if it's okay to read on strings. I don't want to read it first so you think it's okay. What the fuck? I just said, I, yeah, I have a pet. I got stuff. Busta is not that. He is my baby. He's my baby boy. So funny. I think it should be the case. This is in the game. Okay. Alright. I see. So you think enslaving animals is okay. Noted. No. I don't. <laughs> hmm. Next question. Imagine you're on a deserted island with a starving old man and a cute puppy. No, don't. Don't. Don't make me. No. No. I see where this is going. He just had a full course meal and have one apple left. Would you give the apple to the old man or the cute puppy? Oh, that's not where I thought I was going. I thought they were going to make me kill the puppy and give it to the old man and eat, to eat. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'd eat the apple. Give the apple to the old man and give the apple to the dog. Mm. Give the apple to the dog. That way I can cannibalize the man's body. I see. Next scenario. You are stranded on a mountain in winter with your kitten. At this rate, you'll be the first one to die. If the kitten eats your remains, it might survive. Do you accept death in this case, or would you kill your cute kitten for food? What the fuck? No, I would not eat my cat. I'd accept death. I see. Final question. Would you give up your tongue in exchange for leaving this elevator? Give up your tongue in exchange for leaving this elevator? I would not give you my tongue, no. Understandable. Oh, we have arrived. This floor... Oh, I don't want to get off this floor. Let me welcome you to the kitchen. Here, our employees work hard to provide food for everyone in the company. Mmm, that visit looks very tasty. I'm paying. Why don't you join the kitchen? You have nice food here. I'm in pain. 
Yeah, the kitchen is very nice, and... Look, I won't sugar sugarcoat it. The food comes from them, alright? I'm in pain. <laughs> Come on, now. Come on, just a bat. It won't hurt. Mm, no, you aren't deserving of the kitchen. We would like you deserve to go even deeper. Shall we continue, stranger? What fucking company am I at? I may have many questions right now, but I'm legally allowed to not answer any of them. <laughs> oh my god, that is perfect. <laughs> I know you have many questions right now, but I'm legally allowed not to answer any of them. <laughs> oh my god. Just trust me for now. I'll find the best floor for you. As I said before, our company really likes having people like you on board. I won't let you go to waste. This is definitely a game I should play with Hatchet. Ah, it's never pleasant to come to this one. Here's a floor, I guess. Oh. Hey, Bookworm, I found some friends for you. What do you think of them? response no <laughs> no thanks <laughs> let me welcome you to the prison here we bring people that have issues with interpersonal relationships oh that would be shitty friends the people here fail at basic human interactions so please be careful she don't believe any of her lies, stranger. I know the truth about this place. She won't let you out. She'll keep torching you until she becomes bored of it. This floor is not a prison. This is where she puts her broken toys. If you leave now, you'll avoid becoming a freak like us. You have much more luck finding a way out as a normal human. So that's straight to place. Well, everything he said is a lie, except for the last part. It is possible to trade your place in the elevator with one of our employees. You all and other floors would never give up their jobs, but the troublemakers here are different. She 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 Lies, lies. All lies. You have to trust me, stranger. I don't want what happened to me to happen to you. If I'm in the elevator, I can get, I can get revenge on him. And you, you can get away from her. It's a win-win. If we are done here, I think it's time to leave this place now. She, 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 she. Straight places. Just straight places. Stay in the elevator. She, 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 she. You fool. If you're not seeing what she really is. Oh. She's a demon. She's still hot. I assume you've already figured it out. That's right. You're already dead. Right now we are going deeper and deeper into the layers of hell. I'm trying to find which one is most appropriate for you. Our next stop is very special. Maybe you'll find it a bit familiar. 666. Six, six. Here we are. This is our last stop. Let me welcome you to hell. That's right. Just hell. Every floor we visit thus far is also part of hell. This one, however, is very special. You can call it the, the Christian hell or the movie hell. Basically what you imagine when thinking of this place. Lava, sulfur, agony, all the good stuff. This floor is sort of a VIP lounge. All of our most distinguished guests stay, 
stay here. Adolf, Walt, the Kims, even the failed clones, Mr. Jobs. The gang's all here. Do you think you have the pedigree to join such a select group of evil? Well, I'll be the judge of that. Well, I think... That you don't deserve to be here. You're actually way worse than everyone on this floor. You make me sick. What the fuck did I do? What did I do that made me worse than they all? We are going at full speed at the very bottom of hell. That's the only place where you deserve to be. Deeper and deeper and deeper and deeper we go. To the very bottom of hell, to the last layer of damnation we go. Here we are. We've gone so deep that we somehow returned to the starting point. Don't ask me how that works. I don't know either. <laughs> now it's time for the last layer of hell. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> the last layer of hell. Hell. Earth. Let me welcome you to Earth. That's right, this door leads to the worst possible outcome of them all. You'll be reborn and have to go through the entire lifetime in that horrible world of yours. Oh my Satan, I'm surely glad not to be in your shoes right now. Now please, get the fuck out of my elevator and go be a stinky baby. See you in 80 years or so. Bye bye. End eight. Oh shit. I think there was supposed to be a message, but it, it was I accidentally clicked out of it. Oh no. I'm trying to find the fucking... <coughs> Sorry about that.
Oh no, it didn't have a message. Other endings have messages, but apparently ending 8 did not. Okay. I apparently got the good ending. <coughs> Sorry about that. Yeah, I gotta play that with Hatchet, because I'm pretty sure Hatchet was like the elevator girl. What do you think, book one? So. <laughs> mm. Oh my gosh, there's a game I forgot to play on uh, Christmas Eve, Three-Headed Santa. Oh well. That was a cutesy horror game. I did like that. So this game does not have a Twitch category. Next game we're playing is This Game Is Real. Popping up rather soon. And the volume the sixty nine. <coughs> I can jump straight into chapter three, even though I haven't played the previous two chapters. I'm not going to do that. We got this game is real. Okay. Chapter one, dreams. Oh, forgotten dreams. Okay. Well, I don't have a flashlight yet. Zoom! <laughs> Creativity time and love. Zoom on the creepy picture and uh, the bone. Zoom on the on the knight's crotch. Living with others. Still can't use a flashlight. <clears throat> it's 
Sorry about that. Oh, that's just disgusting. Oh my gosh, they're a Twitch streamer with terrible back posture. Did you do it? Childhood memories. Excuse you, what? Oh, this. Oh, you can fuck off. Oh, that's knocked over now. What the fuck? Oh, there's a crack coach. Oh, that's lovely. I can see the outside. All I see is a stone wall. I must be in Berlin. Oh, what the fuck? He's coming. Better hide. Hide where? Damn flu. Wait a minute, what? Yeah, I opened that, that's right. Oh, there's blood here. I did not notice that before. Oh, that actually opened. It looks like I'm about to be arrested by the cops. You, you'll bail me out, right?
Oh, well, that's deeply concerning. Well, that's open now. A headless statue. Fuck. How are you? That is concerning. Oh, my plants are on fire. That means they're healthy, right? So obviously, plants on fire means they're healthy. <coughs> Sorry about that. Can't open that door still. I don't really notice anything different. Guardians. Oh, great. I can never go over and open that. That's great. Oh, I can pick up the batteries now. It's good to know. That's probably what I gotta do now. Just go after and get every battery. Oh, come find me. I have something to show you. Let me get my batteries first. I'd rather have a flashlight with that's fully charged and flashlight that's nearly dead. The bubble vent. There was only three batteries. Weirdly enough. Thought there were more. Well, guess I go into the bloody room. We got a checkpoint. I wish I could fucking see, but I'm... Oh, 
Oh my gosh. I, it did not, I'm not, I'm not sure if it even told me. Told me to hit use Q to load the battery for the flashlight. I don't want to open that door. Oh good, the door stays shut. Yeah, we can keep the flashlight off in this part. There's lights here so I can see. Oh, okay, hi there. We got an 087 thing going on. What's in here? Can't see anything. That's just skull. Oh. Okay. Oh. Oh. Oh, I don't like that. Oh, oh no. Bookworm, what if I told you about messing with the fleshy tentacles? Why did you do this? I thought we were safe with you. You are a monster. <coughs> I told you to not mess with the fleshy tentacles. Now they're free and about. Why did you set the fleshy tentacles free? You are not a monster. They don't understand. I do. Don't look behind you. I don't want to go down there. fuck was that? Well, luckily this thing's easy to avoid. I just have to follow it. I'm not sure if I should follow it down there. Oh crap, I lost sight of it. I don't know which direction it chose. That's a lot of skulls. That's a hand. Was rather easy. Nine one two. Ooh, I'll take that.
So there's a pat there's a code thing somewhere. And the answer is nine one two. The crow. here no I did not <clears throat> this book is important okay so I'm gonna take a picture of those numbers because I'm not gonna remember them Murderer, murderer. <coughs> I see. That's a dead body. Oh god, what the fuck? Yeah, I got a book, bitch. Take the goddamn book. You're still on the fire? Doesn't burn. So I don't know why I can move that around. Move the others around? Maybe I could have done that the entire time. I just didn't realize it. It's just somewhere... Mirrors. There's a thing that I need to put a code into. The Hellhound Heart Storyteller. I am always behind you. Not in the game, in real life. What? I am not alone. You are all keeping a close. We are all keeping a close eye at you. Let us take control, and your suffering will end. Go look inside your head. Well, I can't exactly open my head. Fuck. Oh, the, the ceiling is pulsating. That's great. Well, what the fuck was that? Where I started. Okay, somewhere there has to be a code. Because I got a number code from this 912. So I have to put a code in somewhere. Oh, what the fuck? Where did you come from?
can't go back. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. God damn it. Fucking OBS. It wasn't even a full screen the entire time. Right, now I'm going to have to do a recording of the very beginning. Oh, I didn't even notice that. I'll take that. Apparently I'm being a Christian right now because I'm burning science books. Honestly, kind of lost is what I'm supposed to do. Right, becoming an extremist Christian. Why was I given two codes if there's nowhere to put them? Why, hello there. Would you like to pat on my pussy? I'm sorry. What? Ah. Fucking lost. Where do I put the in that coat? Hug me, grope me, hands, 
Yes. I'll apply to benefit. Yeah, I was not supposed to do that. <laughs> I think I was trying that game another time, mainly because OBS decided to fucking ruin it. Fuck. Is it fucking... And 85 games to look through. Fuck it, we'll go with this one. It's at the very top of my list of games. And it has a Twitch category. I think this is the same creator. Oh my gosh, that's so many games. Yeah, that's so many horror games. Yes, it is. Yeah, um, I think it's the same creator that created that cat one that had the Among Us ending. I think it's the same creator. So this is probably going to be a goofy horror game. It's three minutes with your dog. Now I just have to wait for it to load. Oh, there it goes. Oh my gosh, look at that adorable poochie. Look at the adorable poochie. Interact with the frisbee by pressing E. Oh. Oh, this is so adorable. I don't see what's so terrifying about this. This seems like a. Try and hit the blue area. Fuck. And she is so cute. Yeah. Try and hit the blue area. The hog is gonna be a monster. Fuck. Is just so adorable. I wish I could do this with Busta, but Busta doesn't bring back toys.
What? Uh, hold on. Hold, uh, wait. Hold on. Wait. Who, who the fuck? Who the hell is that? Why do I have two dogs? All of a sudden. Wait a minute. What the fuck? <coughs> Jeez, the horror is getting too many dogs. Uh, I think it's more than that, bookworm. Behind? Well, I can't go behind myself. I can only... Hold Q to turn around. Okay. Keep in there. Oh! It's a dog walking a human. Is, is is this what it wanted me to see? Is, is this the horror that I'm the pet? Kinky, King, goddammit, bookworm. Alright, I'll hydrate. Okay. Let's just keep playing with my doggo. Anything new? Nope. We're just playing with the doggo. I'm not interested. <laughs> Hello, Echo VRC. How are you doing? Yeah. Oh, hi. You're closer. You're gone. Okay. That was a bad throw. I'm getting better. I think that dog food wants attention. <laughs> yeah, true. Anyway, but they don't get my attention. Two. One. Oh, come on! I was right at the edge. Oh, come on! Again, I'm at the edge! <laughs> Finally! As usual, I might pass out here because it's 6 a.m. Oh. Well, don't hurt yourself. You can't. You're not allowed to hurt yourself in my streams. Only I'm allowed to hurt myself. That's how it works.
Fuck. I promise, I promise. <laughs> Just kind of keep throwing it. There's nothing bad behind me. This is just this is just a dog frisbee simulator. This is not a horror game. I'm just playing with my doggle. Ah. He don't want to get really fucking far. I don't know what new horror survival game coming out called Pacific Draft. No, I haven't. But I'll look into it. Well, this is going to be a bad throw. I hit it too early. <laughs> Looks fun, to be honest. Okay. Yes. Got it. This is a bad throw. Yep. <laughs> yeah. Wasn't directly on it, but it, it, it counts. Did the scarecrow get closer? I don't know. Is it getting closer? I had a voice crack right there. I'm not sure if it picked up. <laughs> no, it doesn't look like it's getting... There. Oh. Oh. I can't look around anymore. I can't look back anymore. Bookworm, did you use your teleporting powers? Wait, but there's no blue circle. Oh, that's why. Jesus. Fuck you. Oh my god. <laughs> also, here is a cute dog. That is a clown. That is for a fact a clown. Oh my god. <laughs> Fuck. Did I just play? <laughs> oh, it's not every day your dog turns into a spider. Yeah. So many games to look through.
Okay. Let me just change the steam, uh, stream category. Get the game to actually run, uh, be shown on screen. Popping up. Let's see. No. It is not. Oh shit, I did not mean to hit continue. God damn it. Fuck, I'm gonna have to restart the game. No. God damn it. I am having technical issues. Their brain screen just scared the shit out of me. How do I get it to show up? Will it show up here if I do it here? No. About here. Also no. OBS, you are a ginormous cunt. Well, guess what? I know how to beat the norm ginormous cunt by doing this. It oh, wait. Huh? Why is it not showing up? Oh, there we go. Yeah, it wouldn't work even if I hit new game capture. It still wouldn't show up. Anyways, here we go. Anyways, warning. This test contains material that may be harmful or traumatizing to some audiences. It may also may include visual effects that may harm the viewer. Please proceed with caution. No dogs were harmed. This test is not a virus. No people were harmed. Your information is not going to be used for illegal purposes. Wear headphones. And keep your eyes on the screen. Here's some sort Specialized test development implemented by government agencies to detect data on psychological torture techniques and impact on individuals that serves as a central tool in understanding and effects of fear based manipulation. This test uses your webcam and in oh, wait, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I don't want it to show my face. So give me a moment while I see something. I need to check make sure this game doesn't show my face. <laughs> because I don't want it to do that. I did not know this game would have control of my webcam. <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay, yeah, it will take a picture to show my face on stream. Thank you. Yeah, no, 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 no. I am not do not doxing my face. Oh shit! Turn that off. I mean, you're not seeing anything important. But uh, anyways. Uh, I did not know it would take a picture of my face. Oh no. You auto failed the fear assessment then. The fear of being doxxed, yes. I that's my that's my fear assessment. The fear of being doxxed. <laughs> Alright. Hof now, I know this one won't show my face. Jesus Christ, sound. Stop Station 66. It's the next game. <laughs> okay, we're just staring at static. Yeah, I'm not moving. I'm not touching my keyboard. Good day to you, madam. There's a random sleepy guy on 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 there. That makes sense for a subway. Okay, now I can move. I thought the whole game was just me watching. Hi. Another trick. <clears throat> Duggles. Duggles. You gotta appreciate. What the fuck? Oh no, this is unsettling. I'm gonna get out of here before a train start that uh, starts coming. There's a thumb? What the fuck? Who the fuck are you? Who the fuck are you?
bring around the rosy. You can go fuck yourself. Oh shit. Ooh, okay. Well, you missed me, bitch. Where is he? Oh, he's right behind me. Oh, he's right fucking behind me. Can I help you? There you are, you little pig. Oh, God damn it. I have to go through this again. Mother doctor. So how come the fucking guy was faster than me? What? Wait, what? <laughs> I don't think I was supposed to be seeing that, but okay. So let's first go up here. Open this. Ah. And that's why we need the key. Why were you not here protecting me when the guy was here, Doggles? Because he was scary. Go, 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 go. Run your fat ass. Run your fat ass. Oh shit, that's right, it was over here. Okay, where'd he go? Why don't you follow me up here? Danny? No, I guess not. See you later, bitch! What the fuck? Oh, he's stuck. <laughs> I have broken the game. What did I do? What happened? What? I... Did I... Win? So? The next day, I had to get out of bed. What a nightmare stream. Thank God it was a dream. I should check my answering machine for messages. I can't remember if I visited my friend yesterday or not. Oh, I, I did it. I, I did it because I broke the game. I broke the game. 
<laughs> they got the guy stuck. There's a VHS tape on the TV. I should watch it. Let me see here. Well, first, I gotta check the fucking answering machine. Where's the goddamn answering machine? You have one old message. Thursday, 2 09 p.m. Power to be a chess player first. Also, who puts this much fucking white in a room? Fucking hell. Okay, now we got a tape. <coughs> <coughs> it's a subway. There's nothing all that different about it. subway What the fuck did I, I, I just watch? Well, anyways, that doesn't concern me anymore. What else am I supposed to do? I washed the tape. Now what?
And I can't put the tape back. Hmm. I can't tell this is an exploring game over or not. much confused as to what the fuck I do. I just lost the tape they gave me. Well, it's gone. <laughs> what do I do? I literally, I think I pretty much broke the game. A bookworm. I broke the game. What do you think I should do? Oh, wait, never mind. I forgot I had more doors. Oh. That's a body bag. Subway killer caught. On June 7th, 1996, a young man suffering from delirious thoughts was found to be the murderer involved in multiple subway murders in our small city. This happened during the night of June 6th. The subject was found at his apartment the day after the incident, but he pleads to officials he is he was not at the scene of the crime and was with his psychiatrist for a doctor's visit. The subject had the murder weapon in it in his bathroom, a bleak kitchen knife, and a body of one of his victims zipped up in a body bag. For further evidence, police found VHS tapes recording the subject's deeds. The only way I was able to get that ending was because I broke the game. By making, like, the, the guy who was supposed to kill me no longer being able to fucking get me. <laughs> I am... I am the god of breaking games. No, I do not. I don't have that. Sorry. <laughs> Anyways. The last game of tonight, it's going to be Isolation Simulator. This game, don't be sorry. Yeah. But I can look into it. Uh, do, do, run away. Run away. Oh. 
Oh shit. I have no idea if it's showing up on stream, is it? Yes, it is. Yeah! Alright, Isolation Simulator. I can't look down or up. I can only look sideways. Uh, excuse you? Where's my lights? Fuck off. I'm supposed to be isolated, bitch. What the fuck is this voice? It sounds like a young child on helium. <laughs> Is this just the game where it's just be this voice? Maybe it's the young kid who spent too much time in your balloons. What? I was just spamming E everywhere. Wait, how how are there cans coming up from up there? Fill my rooms with cans. Do it, bitch. I wish I can look up and down, but I can only look side to side. Oh my god. They're listening to my request. They're filling my room with cans. Oh wait, those aren't cans. Those are mugs. I'll still take them. <laughs> what the fuck? Um, okay. That's a person. It sure is a person. I how do I get this off my screen? Oh, my my mouse is also on the screen now. Oh. That's why my mouse is on the screen. Come here, bitch. Come here, bitch. Oh. Now my mouse is no longer on the screen. Fucking seizure warning. Jesus. Can I have my lights back? Alright, now what's gonna fucking happen? Well? Oh, God damn it! 
Not you again. Okay, and I was yelling that time. Okay, now I'm really fucking confused. What the fuck's gonna happen? I don't appreciate not having a handle on my door, by the way. What if I need to go to the bathroom? You have to let me go to the bathroom, you know. Oh. What the fuck? I must be careful, O oh Lord my God, my Holy One. For you there is no death. O oh Lord, it has been ordered by you for our punishment. And by you, O oh Lord, he has been marked out to act as right. Fuck. Well, the door's open again. Bookworm, did you lock me in here? Worst thing imaginable for a streamer. The blue screen. <laughs> I have no idea how long this game is. I have yet to be scared, which is good. I am no longer the piss baby. I am... The piss master. <laughs> uh, can you open the door? No? Well, fuck you. <laughs> I'm just sitting here waiting. Up, oh, it's cups again. Except they're phasing through the walls. Bookworm, what did I do to get locked up in here? <laughs> you're laughing because you're throwing mugs of face through the floor. Yeah, I'm, I'm so fucking scared. Bitch, come out and face me, motherfucker. Face the piss master. Christ, I'm gonna definitely when it goes to YouTube, I'm gonna have to put a seizure warning. Yeah, 
going to do something? Because I'm getting kind of bored, bud. I don't know lights, why I'm so scared. Even though it looks like that light's illuminated. Oh, it's the, it's the child bitch again. I don't, so fuck off. No. No, I won't. Fuck off. You're adopted. Like I said, you're adopted. Fuck off. Child, where the fuck you are? Go away. You're adopted. What's this from again? I must be terrified, oh lord my god. My holy land. For you there is no death. Oh lord, it has been ordered by you for our punishment. And by you, oh lord, he has been marked out to act as right. God damn it, not again. Oh, it's still going. Oh my god. Get off my screen. Oh, I can crouch. Bookroom, you still haven't answered me on why I'm even locked up in this place. I would like to know why. <coughs> Sorry about that. Music? This is this is okay ish music. For repeating the one joke too many times. So I wasn't so I'm not being arrested for burning down 420 mental asylums? Okay. That's good. Well, that was short. I'm fucking bored just sitting in this goddamn room give me something 
or give me death. Oh god damn it, not the cups again. Can you at least drop alcohol with the cups? That will be appreciated. So I'd like to get drunk off my ass. Even though I really haven't done that yet. <laughs> yeah. 